This is a video on social extensions, accelerating extensions, and video extensions. I'm going to go through uh, actually setting up a social extension and then uh, I will uh, briefly explain what the accelerating extension and video extensions are. First of all, you can see I am at the Add Extensions tab and the Social Extensions drop down. And just a brief reminder on what a social extension looks like. You can see this ad right here. Um, if you are a Google Plus member and some of the people within your circle have plus one the particular business that you're searching for, you'll see that information right in the Google AdWords ad. As you can see, that's pretty powerful to know that uh, people that you know or are associated with have found this company beneficial. So we're going to go back to the interface here. And this is a pretty self-explanatory, but you, uh, you choose a new extension, choose the campaign that you want the extension to show in, and then you enter the URL for your Google Plus page. And then uh, that's it. That's, that's how you set up a social extension and um, would highly recommend you do it if, if you are a Google Plus member. And just to briefly touch on the other two types of extensions I mentioned earlier, we've got a seller rating extension. And you can see here that the these little gold stars here with reviews and down here is an extension that you don't have to set up, but there are specific requirements to actually set up, uh, have the uh, um, accelerating extensions um, appear in your account. And you can go to this URL here and learn about the specific requirements and how many reviews you've got to have for the accelerating extensions to take effect. There's nothing you need to do within your AdWords account. It just automatically takes effect when you when you comply with all Google's regulations on this ad extension. And then you can see the video extension here, which is a plus box, just like the location extension. And when you hit the plus box here, the drop down video screen shows up. And when the searcher plays the video for more than 10 seconds, the advertiser is charged just as if somebody would click on their ad. And then after the video is done playing, the searcher can click on the video or the ad and go to the landing page designated. And that's it. Please tune in for other tutorials on ad extensions.